analyzing secondary dominance. There are five chords used as dominance. Each has a different quality. They are the five chord, which is a major triad, the five seven, a major minor seventh chord, the seven triad, which is diminished, the seven half diminished seventh, a diminished minor seventh, and the fully diminished seven chord, which is a diminished diminished seventh chord. Any of these can be used as a secondary dominant of a temporary tonic. A temporary tonic is any major or minor triad that is temporarily tonicized. There are three steps in analyzing a secondary dominant. First, determine the quality of the chord. This will determine which dominant to use. Next, find the temporary tonic. If it is a 5 or 5 7, go down a perfect fifth from the root of the dominant. If it is one of the 7 chords, go up a minor second to find the temporary tonic. The 7 chord is the leading tone of the temporary tonic. Third, write at the root of the temporary tonic as a Roman numeral. Here are examples in the key of B flat. The first step is to determine the quality of the chord. This is a D, F sharp, A, C chord, which is a major minor seventh, so it is a 5 7. This chord is spelled E natural, G, B flat, D, so it is a diminished minor seventh, or a 7 half diminished 7 chord. The second step is to find the temporary tonic. Since we discovered this is a 5-7, go down a perfect fifth from the root of the dominant to find the temporary tonic. Down a fifth from D is a G. G is the temporary tonic. This chord is a 7 half diminished seventh. Go up a minor second from the root of the 7 chord because it is the leading tone of the temporary tonic. E natural is the leading tone to F, so F is the temporary tonic. The third step is to write the temporary tonic as a Roman numeral. G is a 6 in the key of B flat, so you would write 5 7 of 6. F is the temporary tonic in this chord. F is a 5 chord in the key of B flat, so this chord is a 7 half diminished 7 of 5. Now to review. First, determine the chord quality. Second, find the temporary tonic. And third, write the root of the temporary tonic as a Roman numeral.